Hello everybody out there in Facebook land. It's Heather Zibarth, your Goofy Cargill, coming at you from ID Chrysler. I am going to do a virtual tour, virtual test drive on this beautiful 2016 Ram 1500 Rebel. Come along. All right, going to start here at the front. As usual, I always do a nice scan for you to see on our used vehicles in case there's anything that I miss. You can see if there's any dents, dings, scratches, any of those pre-loved stuff that, you know, happens. Right at the front, I absolutely love the uh, intake. The hood on the Rebels are super cool. The nice blacked out sport grill. Got tow hooks on the front. Got some really nice off-road tires and rims. Underneath that hood, you have got the 5.7 liter Hemi V8 engine. Some nice running boards. Matches really nice with the uh, black logos and the black grill and the back black side mirrors. Let's take a look at the back seat here. One awesome thing about the Rebels in 2016 is this really nice black and red interior that I love so much. The seats actually have um, a special like tire, uh, I don't know what you call that, tire seat. Uh, we'll flip this up so you can see. There's a little bit of storage underneath there. And then these also do fold out like kind of like a table that way you can uh, have a flat floor of course the other side does this as well it does have uh, some aftermarket uh, accessories here that are being included you have a rubber floor mat always nice and then underneath here it's kind of hidden you have the ram exclusive in-floor storage so you just pop that up and it's an insert, so you can pull that out, so you can clean that out, so uh, you can put whatever you want in there. Some ice and waters, beer, I don't judge. Very nice and clean interior. The front seats also have the red and black interior. Nice Ram logo. And then back here, you have some vents, and then an AC adapter in case you need to plug something in back here. Do have a little bit of scuff on the uh, wheel where wheel well there got mud flaps though got all kinds of great accessories on this a very nice soft roll-up tonneau cover rebel logo black bumper as well you have parking sensors in the back help keep you safe and your hookups, lights for your license plate, and your class four receiver hitch. Let's open this up. You do have a backup camera on there as well. It's nice and clear. We'll see that in a little bit. Bed liner. You've got that really nice tonneau cover as well. It's really easy to roll that up. I love it. Come on, oh, keep scanning. Definitely don't see too many scratches or dents at all. There is a very small one right here, if you're really looking. And on the other side, when I lift this up, you can see we've got another speaker back here so it's got a great sound system all right
right, this does have proximity entry, so that means I can lock the door with that button and then unlock it right there. There's a sensor, it just unlocks it, so that's really nice. Open her up. So on the passenger seat, you do have uh, power seats, power lumbar. Underneath here, you do have um, your car jack. Nice uh, Mopar rubber floor mats there. Power locks, power windows. You have two glove boxes, one up top and one down below. Love the red accents in this one. Easiest to see right over here. You have a 115 volt household plug. Some little cubbies here and here for the tiny little things. Got a pocket right here. Okay, we'll look at some of the other accessories when we get over to the driver's side. One thing that I do love about this 2016 is that it does have air ride suspension. And as a short girl, I do love that right here from the keychain, there's also a remote start, but I can push this down and it will bring it down to an easy entry level. You can see that in the video, it's lowering itself. So now a short girl like me can get in with ease. So let's go take a look from the driver's side. I gotta turn this back on because it's still lowering. Gotta be able to see just how low it goes. There we go. Super nice and easy for me to get in. From the driver's side, you're gonna see power locks, power windows, power side mirrors. You've got some extra cup holders in here, little, little cubbies. That's where I put my wrappers, my husband hates it. And power seats, power lumbar, again with this beautiful red and black look going on in here. Okay. All right, let's start her up. All right, so first thing you can see the nice display in front of you with the different pages and it lets you know in here what level your air ride is at. It's on an entry exit level right now. And I can go over here. There's a button that you can push to lower and then one to raise. So I'll push that up. And while we're talking, we'll let it raise up to off-road height is what that would be called when it goes all the way up. So from here, uh, you've got tow brakes, you've got your heated seat, heated steering wheel buttons. Uh, always a super duper nice feature having that. You've got your tow haul mode. You have a charging pad right here. Works really slick. I already tried it. You do have an aftermarket uh, CD player, so there's a great sound system in here with navigation in there as well. You've got your four-wheel drive. And then let's see what else oh this does have this is a connected vehicle uh that would be a subscription that works with sirius xm that i could help you with if that were something that were of interest to you uh you have the garage door openers universal garage door openers a button to open your window in the back nice feature electric or power window very nice and clean. Got the Alpine sound system. And then you can page through, check out the health of your truck, keep track of your fuel economy and things like that. Your trailer brakes. 
and you can customize this as well. On your steering wheel, you have everything at your fingertips, your Bluetooth, your, um, your gears, your cruise control, and then on the back side is uh, your radio controls. On your left and right side, you have radio controls. So looking down here, you've got another spot to put a cell phone or two if you wanted, a couple cup holders, and then I think this would be an aftermarket um, add here as well. This pulls right out and um, you actually have a couple extra USB ports there. And in your glove box right in here, you've got a coin sorter, some extra space, and then USB ports and SD card as well. And you can open it up for some extra storage in there as well. So I think we should take this baby for a drive. All right, here we go. I'm gonna get out on the interstate so you can see what that looks like. Radio works. All right, highway speed. happened while we were driving was that the truck automatically brought the ride suspension down to uh, the perfect ride height for driving on the interstate. I didn't tell it to do that, just did that on its own. Alright, just getting back here and I realized that I didn't show you how nice and clear that backup camera is and how nice it is to let me know just how close I am to that truck behind me with the red and the yellow and the green. It is beeping at me a little bit just to let me know that it's there, but if I were to back up a little more then the beeping would increase as it gets into the yellow. Works pretty nice. Let's take a look under the hood. All right, thanks for riding along. As always, check out our inventory at idchrysler.com. Come see me, your goofy car gal, for a virtual ride or an in-person ride. Catch you later.